I've gone all Kaizen crazy again. What am I talking about? Well, stick with me because we're going to jump into this together and I'm going to explain. Let's go. Welcome to this episode of DIY3DTech.com. In this episode of Kaizen Craziness, one of the things I'm going to do is show you how I designed up or created a model to hold my tools for 3D print cleanup. Now, three tools that I use all the time for 3D print cleanup is this deburring tool, an X-Acto knife, and uh, I don't know what you call these. It's a straight razor or something of the like. So I use these three tools all the time. So I want to keep them handy. I want to keep them safe. They're, they're sharp tools. This isn't too bad. Uh, but I want to protect, you know, the tools. I want to protect myself. And I want to have a place that I just go and I can get what I need. So this is what I designed up. Now, pretty simple and straightforward. I made it out of cardboard as I did the Caliber Kaizen cutout. So this guy has two basic separate templates. One is cut out for the deburring tool, and then one also has a cutout for the X-Acto knife. Because this is shallower, I went with just one of these. So you can go with two of these if you want. You can change this up however you want. However, for me, the way that this works is I have a solid base. I take one of these, put it on top. I take a second one to increase depth. And then I put a third on top with the X-Acto knife. Uh, actually, I want to switch these two so the blue ends up down here. Or you could have the blue there uh, either way. Then basically what happens is this sits here. That drops in here. The razor blades actually go in here. Once they're aligned, they'll go in a little bit better. And then the X-Acto knife sits in here. Now we still have to glue all this up, but I want to kind of give you an idea how it all works. So let's go ahead, let's glue this guy up and uh, see how it turns out. Okay, so here's the unit all assembled. So I've got space for three razors to go in here. I've got for my deburring tool. And again, I can just pick up my X-Acto knife and it sits down here into this. Uh, I might change this up a little bit more in the future. I actually have it so it can lay on its side uh, and I can pick it up out of here. And then obviously the deburring tool comes out. Notice how I designed in these finger grab areas so I can reach in there and pick them up. So this is actually pretty cool. Now one of the pieces that I did as I atypically do is I covered the top with a polyurethane or a sealer. This makes this really strong and makes the cardboard last a lot longer. So anyways, I'll have this model out on the design store. So if you want to get one of these and you're a 3D printing enthusiast and you want a piece of this Kaizen craziness, go out there, grab this model. It's free. Go ahead and make it. Um, let me know in the comments below what other type of Kaizen craziness you guys would like to see. And I'll see about obliging. So with that, be sure to give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe is going to be over there. Swag shop up there. This will be out on the design store. And we'll catch you in the next video where we do something else cool. Cheers. Please click like below and subscribe to the channel to keep up to date on all of our projects.